Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do number 1929, concatenation of array, and we're going to be solving this in JavaScript. So we have a function that we want to get concatenation and then takes in nums. Nums, here we see is an array of nums, and here's the example. And it wants us to return a new array where it just concatenate, con concatenates both of these together. So we have one, two, one, and then one, two, one, one, two, one. So it's just add this again to itself. So how we can solve this is that we can use this current nums so we array and then just loop through it again and push these new values to it itself. So, but before we do that, like a normal for loop in arrays, we do um, for the i equals zero, i is less than uh, the array, so nums.length. But in this case, if you keep pushing it, it's gonna keep getting longer. So first we want to find create a variable of the length of the nums array. So create original nums length, and we set it equal to nums dot length. So this is the indicator of when we're going to start our for loop. After that, we can loop through nums, and inside of it, we can push the nums of i um, to nums. So we'll loop through here, uh, get the one, and we push it to the back two, push it to the back one, push it to the back. And we do this, the length of it, so zero, one, two, we do it that many times. And we can just return nums at the end. Great. So here we do const original nums then equals nums dot length. Now we do a for loop for let i equal zero. I is less than original nums length, I plus plus. And inside of it, we just push it in the array. So nums dot push nums index of I. And we can just return nums. Sorry. This needs to be in parentheses. Great. We got it. So now the time and space complexity. So since we're doing a loop of nums, so it's going to be O of n, where n is the length of nums, and then a the space complexity. Since we're adding to this original array, the original length is also going to be the same of O of n, where n is the length of nums. So that's how you solve this problem. Thank you so much.